Back so, to for anyone that's not here, <laughs> oh my fucking make god! Make sure you guys relay the information we're gonna talk about here in this meeting. We're gonna try to keep this as brief as possible. I need everybody here to be on the same page. All right. Mm -hmm. Cypress Flats has been hot as fuck, and things gotta start changing moving forward. And I'm not talking about one or two of us making a little bit of a difference. I'm talking about all of us as a collective. So from this day moving forward. We start pressing back hard. Arusha's going to go down through the, through the details of what the, what that exactly means and what that entails. But again, if there's anybody missing from this meeting, I need you all to make sure that they're all informed as to what exactly is going to go down. Capiche? I understood. Got it. it. Capiche? Aye, it. aye. Understood. Bene. Arush, go ahead. All right. So, guys and girls, I want you to raise your fucking hand if you got a pistola. All right? Yeah, you see, that's not many. So the only way you can strike back, obviously, is by force. Now, police are keep fucking with us. But the only way they learn is when you fuck with them. Yes. This is this is operations fuck policy. Yeah. And this is how we do it, okay? There are multiple ways. People, from now on, when we fucking be selling on the streets, we're going to have all this one guy or one girl with a pistola on a motorbike. Ready, get it? When a cop pull up, like today, then tries to pull up to arrest somebody, you pull up to that cop, shoot him in the fucking head. <laughs> you know what I mean? And tell him, stay out of Cyprus, and everybody dip. After that, everybody chill for like half hour, get it? Put away your stuff, blah, blah, blah. Now, if you ain't got a gun, what you gonna do? This is what you do. You fuck with them. I mean, mental warfare. If some, if a certain cop is fucking with you, you know this is what you do. You go put away your stuff. You go grab one or two girls or guys. You guys go get wrenches. You follow them. When they're about to, let's say, arrest somebody, you know, and go to PD to chill or, you know, they go to hospital or whatever. When they park in their car to buy a food, what you going to do? You're going to be there. You're going to smack their cars. You're going to steal their cars. You're going you're gonna to bankrupt them. Get it? You're going to be a pain in his fucking ass, you know? You're going to be a pain in the ass. And when they come through here, when they come to Cyprus, is one guy, two guys coming. Look around you. If you fucking six deep, you know, and you don't see them pulling the gun yet, you fucking all charge him from the back, front, whatever. Make Hit them in the fucking face and dip. Hit and dip. But the pressure got to be there. If you see some, uh, one cop pull up, all you remember what we're doing in earlier hours? All of you guys pull up with your cars, bikes, everything. Surround them. Be like, what you doing here? What you doing here? You need to show your presence. You see what I'm saying? But here's the most important thing. In a couple days from now, I want everybody to at least have one gun. If you can't find none, don't worry. I'm going to be working to get you guys guns too. So either you find a gun or you get the money ready to buy a gun and I buy a gun for you guys and give it to you guys. Get it? Mm -hmm. So we're going to be going to be making it real hard here. We're going to make it fucking like no tomorrow. Police are come, you take care of it. If you ain't taking care of it, you ain't made for the street. And if you ain't made for the street, there's no shame. You can leave. You get me? But this is not a kindergarten, you know what I'm saying? You sell mota, get money, and get rich or die trying, right? At the end, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yep. So just be, look and look around you. All of you guys, some of you guys are from later hours, some of you guys earlier hours. But all of these people and pr probably like 10 more people work for us, get it? So you can trust everybody here. But remember, if somebody's stepping up, taking charge, don't be like, yo, what you doing? What I'm doing? Just follow each other. Help each other out. You know what I mean? Work with each other. And that's how we keep it safe. Right now, we got a jo John. He got locked up. But guess what we did? We tried to still save him. We shoot some rock. We tried to ranch. You know, it is what it is. Get it? But I don't want like, you know, if some of you guys getting chased, I don't want four motherfuckers be like, but I'm going to keep selling. No, you're not. You're going to put away your stuff and you're going to help each other out. Yeah. But right. it's time to bring it on for police. Yeah. I mean, like, fully bring it on. Everybody should gather up their rocks. When you guys <laughs> chilling, go gather rocks. Everybody should have at least minimum two, three rocks. Throw it at their cars and shit. Harass them. Fuck with them. Follow them. I right? Don't let them fucking bite you over. This is our turf and not their turf, yeah? Hey, Arush, where, where do you get those? Where do you get those rocks? You told it. Uh, up north. You can find Fuck. them, I think, on the mountains, too, for free. I think you just okay. gotta go look. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, there are ways to get rocks, you know, get rocks, get wrenches, rocks and wrenches, bandages, and if you can, pistolas, if not, we'll provide you. But remember, 
You gotta go fucking crazy, you know? No tomorrow. I mean, like, everybody charge and go crazy. That's how we do it. Remember the wars we had with the company? They had pistola. What did we do? We outsmarted them. Started using bikes and wrenches. You see what I mean? Stuff like that. Bait them into corners, you know? You see what I'm saying? They, these cops are dumb. They can only follow a fucking moving light, you know? If you stop moving, they don't even realize it. You see what I'm saying? Set them up. Be smart. When you guys get caught, change radio stations. From tomorrow, we're going to have three different radio stations. Uh, I'll come up with them. Uh, me and the boys here will come up with them. From tomorrow, we give you guys. If somebody gets caught, you switch to radio two and then radio three. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So we always have communication. If you guys are deep selling, get somebody with a camera from news to go up on top of the uh, top of the building here. Maybe hold down the area. Watch out for cops in here and there. Because if you can message like, yo, a cop is about to make a move right now. Then you can put away your motta and you know, then you guys can focus on the cop. Get it? Just be smart, yeah? Understood, boys. Aight. Except that. Good job, everybody. Everybody here been doing good. Selling good motta, making good money. And you know, uh, the people are doing great. So, you know, we're proud of you guys. But now we, got, we got, want you guys to get fucking hard, okay? Yeah. Okay! Okay. Sure. Fuck yeah. 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 Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. It's fucking right. Go loco. Yeah. All right. Any questions? Yeah. Any suggestions? Any 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 plans? Strategies? Anything you gotta you gotta say? Say it now. I I, I will say something. You know, uh, uh, we're, we're talking about direct action here against the police department. All right. Some somebody's gonna get fucking caught. Somebody's gonna get shot down. Somebody's gonna get beat down with a baton. Whatever it is. In any case possible, I would try to get rid of any illegal items that you might have on your properties, in your vehicles, anything at all. Because if you get raided as a result of what we're going to be doing here, you're going to be you're going to be in big fucking trouble. So try to be as squeaky clean everywhere else before you start getting involved in direct direct action. That's my recommendation, anyway. You ain't going to get raided if you uh, if you if, if we start clapping the you know these these fucking cops and whatnot. But uh, you know if you get arrested while you have some product on you, then then it's then it's different. That's why he said. Put your put your shit away before you uh you know you go out to do some some hits. And hey, on the ground, if you out. get raided, if you get raided, then you fucking made it. Get it? Don't worry. Mm. If you get raided, like that's how life goes. This is the fucking path you guys choose. You just gotta keep your fucking mouth shut. And when you get out, maybe we even have a nice little bonus for you. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but you gotta go hard. You know you gotta go all the way in, man. You know don't give a fuck what you got in your house or not. Get it? That's the life you guys took, you know? Yeah. Hell yeah. All right. Anything else? Anybody else? <laughs> okay. Make sure you guys let uh, those that aren't here know about what we discussed. We got a lot of people right now. So if you're all going to be pushing, uh, go ahead and, uh, and do so. If you need any, any, any stuff from me, you let me know, right? Gotcha. All right. Oh. Good luck, okay. Buona Fortuna, and Buona Caccia. Happy hunting. All right, thank you. And guys, remember, 1,000 bags minimum a week. No fucking excuses. Around earlier hours, you know, you guys come to me for product, you know what I mean? I take care of it, but around these hours, if I'm not around, if you're my usual guy or girl, I'm not around, this is the guy, get it? And potentially more guys, but you know, right now, that's the guy, yeah? Yep. So, you know, behave. Now, back to work! Thank you for the meeting. Yes, sir. Thank you.